what it is. It would be. I think we are seeing some kind of a, uh, a power surge in the building and it may be because of power surge. What's the sound? You know, we have to try to figure out what we're going to do about him. He's, he's been causing all kinds of trouble and now short circuit is gone. Uh, you know, have you seen short circuit lately? No, not since last Sunday. Uh oh. What's that I hear? <laughs> oh. Never! Never! 
will you defeat me? Oh, I'll defeat you! Oh, puny yeah. and weak! Yeah. I'll show you I puny and weak! I am strong and muscular no, 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 no. I am awesome! Oh, you're a loser! <laughs> <laughs> you will no, fail, no, Dr. Sparky! No, you will fail! Yeah. <laughs> no, <laughs> Just as I have destroyed no, Dr. Dark, no, no, no. I will destroy you! I'm <laughs> <laughs> you! <laughs> Take that, Dr. Sparky! Girls, short circuit, Bernice. Yeah. You go. Yes. Go to the secret place of meeting. The secret place of meeting. And I will join you there. Because I am about to destroy Dr. Dark forever! trying to get us thinking that he's more powerful than us, but he has no power at all. All he is is a big sissy who's still whining over his pussycat. That's all it is. <laughs> yeah, why didn't he show up today? I don't know. He couldn't show up in the room. I think he's afraid of us. That's what I think it is. And did you notice Short Circuit? Yeah, that's the truth. She kept saying Jesus is awesome, and then she'd say Power Surge is awesome. I think she's about to slip out of it. I think, I think we're this close I to getting so. Short Circuit back. You know what, that reminds me of today's power verse. Do you remember what today's power verse was? Psalm 37 and 5. Commit thy way unto the Lord, trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. This is what we must do. You know, last week we prayed a prayer of faith over a short circuit so that, sh that we could get her back. And I think that that prayer of faith is starting to work. Because we trust. Because we trusted God. But you know what we need to do? Now we need to do a different kind of prayer. We don't need to pray a prayer of faith because that prayer has already been changing and it's working. Now we need to do just a prayer of consecration. Where we call it a prayer of consecration. Consecration, where you give it all to God. We're going to turn everything over oh, to God today. Kind of like orange juice whenever it's concentrated? No, 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 no. Consecrated. Don't worry, I'll explain that to you later. Consen the consen what? What? We're going to put all of our trust in God. Okay? That's what we're going to do, all right? Let's get together. Let's pray a prayer together right now. We're going to pray that power surge is defeated and that we're going to get short circuit back and God's going to restore everything back to normal here at the factory. Heavenly Father, we thank you today because we know, Lord, that you, on you alone, are the one that we put our faith and our trust in. And so today, we know that you're going to help us to overcome Power Surge and Dr. Dark and restore the factory back together. We are not going to worry and not going to fret about the things that he is saying and, and, and that he's running his mouth about because we know who we have our trust in and we know who we have believed in and we know that you are able to do anything exceedingly and above and beyond what we could ever ask or think. And so today, God, we put our trust in you, and we know that Short Circuit will return to us. And we know that, that Power Surge will be defeated, and that we will be able to regain control back of the factory and not have any more of the trouble from the outsiders from the year 2020. God, we put our trust and confidence in you today, and we're not going to worry about it anymore. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. And now... When you pray the prayer of consecration like this, you don't want to worry about it. So we're just going to go on back. We're going to pray and believe God for the change that he's going to do right here. Right, guys? Yeah. And before long, before long, we will know power surge's weakness. I'm sure he has one. Probably his cat. That's a big weakness. All right. Well, we'll see you later, kids, okay? And remember, don't, don't worry about what Dr. Dark or Dr. Shut power surge is doing. Oh, you are right. I do need to shut down the time circuits. Wait, turn it back on last time. Wait, you have to turn it back on. Power Surge is a robot. I bet you can't turn it back on. Oh, there's still one more. I bet he is a robot. Is he a robot? Yeah. No. Riley, he's from the future. Oh, because last time, remember? Dr. Stark, what do you think Power Surge is a robot? Power Surge a robot? Yeah, because last time when you were back in time, he knew how to turn on the... Uh, he turned it on without, without, 
Well, I do know that he is from the future. He's in the year 2020. And 10 years from now, there probably are things that we don't have here at our disposal. So I don't know. It's possible that he learned how to do anything. He may have even a remote control that works from the future. I've never seen anybody be able to do a video transmission from the future. And Dr. Dark figured out how to do that. And he's a dork. Yeah, so. but Power Surge may have shown him how to do that. Power Surge probably did, because Dr. Dark couldn't figure that out on his own. Yes, it could be that awesome thing that is causing these problems. But we're not going to worry about it. We're going to trust God and let God reveal it to us what it is about our hand. So let's go on back to the lab and make sure that everything is safe at the lab. We'll see you later, kids. Bye-bye.